Hello everybody, this is Sirik 1983 and welcome back to Neverwinter Nights. Alright, this could be rather interesting. Come on, Sherman. Fall in behind me here. Come on. Fair enough. I gotta do this like one step at a time. So I'm pretty sure that we're okay, yeah, Sherman, you stay. Stand there. your ground <laughs> over there. This might Fair hurt. Enough. Well, maybe not. Sweet. All right, what do we got? Ooh, some nice shurikens. Dragon's tail. Huh. No, that doesn't sound expensive at all. <laughs> all right, what's over here? Oh, oh right, more spoiler coins. Holy jeez. Three potions of restoration as well. What's in here? Uh, potion of foxes coming. All right. All right, come on, Sherwin. Fall in behind me here. Fair enough. Behind me. Fall in Thank behind you. me here. Alright. Great, now I'm gonna have two extras. <laughs> uh, I got too many now. Oh well. I'll sell them I guess. Alright, now let's go in the front door. Hello. Oh, this must be their hideout. <laughs> Otano for Digama. Ah, missed again. <laughs> oh well. Garnet. Oh, yeah. Well, I guess the the, the gem I was thinking of isn't down there. I know I get one of them. I know that. Oh, big trap. Light wounds. Anything else? Here, serious ones. Hey, it's about time. All right, let's see what this door can do to me. Stand your ground over there. Fair enough. Eh, not bad. Fall in. Hello. Otano for Digamon! Ha! Alright, any remains? Hey, he's got some. Alright, let's go upstairs. Eek. Ah, uh, that's good suck. I should probably go over that instead of Charlotte. Alright. There we go, got it all. There! Otano for Digama! Gonna hit him there, Cal. Thank you. There! <laughs> that was a little too close for comfort. Alright, what did he drop? Tire Maze plus one again. Holy jeez. Uh, I know I can make something out of that, but do I have the items for it again? Uh, dire mace. No, I don't have the iron wood anymore. Oh well, I'll sell it anyway for a few hundred gold. Fair enough. Uh, am I able to rest? Or are there people in there? All right then. I guess it is. What'd I lose? Okay. <laughs> it completely failed. Yeah, let's avoid that one. And more shurikens. Grains of sand again. Is that a desk? Yes, it is. Ten gold. All right, sure. When you get out here, because I don't want you to die. Fall in behind me here. Fall in behind. Stand your ground over there. Turn around. There we go. This could hurt. Or not. Uh, 
There we go. What do we got? Orders from Calic. Oh, this must be a Calic cell, so we got two more smugglers' coins. <laughs> Tavern key. Let's take a look. This note consists of hastily scrawled instructions, mostly orders, to members of a search party. The old fool has, has to be somewhere. Even Vengal can't disappear into thin air. I want patrols by the ship, and I want someone to get a hold of that damn wench he favors. She's usually around the seedy tavern somewhere. Take her downstairs and find out where Vengal would hide himself. Shut down all his plans, boys, and we find that when we find that fool, we'll be rich as kings. I won't let him give up the chance at the largest ransom we've ever seen. We're doing things my way now. Calic. Ooh, sounds like some, uh, what's that called? Uh, mutiny. Fall in uh, behind at least we got some uh, information about it. Uh, there's apparently somebody that Vengal is quite fond of. Man, that failed again. Alright. So yeah, that key I got I think actually opens that door now, but uh, let's go in the front door because well, there's some stuff I want to buy with the smugglers coins. Alright, let's go. Oh, hang on, no. Yeah, okay, so the idea with this door is that if you're not wearing a blood sailor uniform, you have to bribe with uh, uh, smugglers coins, but if you wear the uh, blood sailor uniform, you get in for free. to the door and let's have a look at you, shall we? Hmm, I see a blood sailor uniform. Good enough, but watch yourself. You or any friends make trouble and out you go. Alrighty, we're inside and we can take this damn thing off now. <laughs> Alright, I'm not naked anymore. Alright, let's go talk to the auctioneer. Greetings. Blasted Vengal, I've paid good money for some of these things and now he's get late getting the show going. Ah, heck with it. Anyone want to buy some things? I've got smuggler co Smuggler's Coin Specials. Right, let's take a look at some of your special items. Number of things. Would you like weapons, armor, or my miscellaneous goods? Right, let's take a look at your weapons. I've got a magic double axe. It's an exotic weapon. It's very nice. It's 15 Smuggler's Coins. Basically, it's a magic... Yeah, it's a double axe plus one. Magic longsword. Bad longsword plus one. Martial weapon is very nice. It's 10 Smuggler's Coins and a Morning Star. Yeah. All of these weapons and all that stuff are all plus one, but alright, let's go with the uh, long sword here. That takes up ten of them. And let's go with the morning star as well. Uh, what about your armor? I have a medium magical breastplate. It's medium armor for 15 smugglers' coins. I have this magical shield for nine, and leather armor for five. Uh, let's go with uh, Hmm. Yeah, let's go with the, the shield, the leather armor. And I'll... Eh, what about your miscellaneous items? Nymph Cloak, which is made by the Nymphs, and a, a steel at 14 smugglers' coins, a magical sash, six... Eh, let's go with the magical sash. Actually, how many do I have left? Uh, ten, so... Eleven, okay. Hmm, hmm. Alright, let's see what else we got here. Some special items, armor, 15, okay, uh, weapons, 15, alright, miscellaneous, 14, 6, alright, sash it is. <laughs> alrighty, there we go, awesome. So, yeah, that's all we get here. Um, yeah, I don't have much time left, so yeah, I'm gonna actually teleport back to the, uh, Temple of Tear, and then I'll head to the uh, Shiny Knight's Arms and Armor, and I'll meet you downstairs with uh, Merrick to uh, show you what I plan to do with some of this stuff. Alrighty, so here we go. Use up some more of those forging items. Alright, I want to... Okay, this is what I was talking about with the, the uh, Gargoyle Skull. Put the... Oh, this is Leather Armor Plus One. Damn it, I should have uh, gotten it. Oh yeah, I was going to identify them. Alright, I'll be right back. Alrighty, so I, I uh, identified everything. This is the sash of shimmering we got, and this is the leather armor plus one and a large shield plus one. Alright, let's. Uh, the only thing I'm actually gonna forge is the leather armor, because I didn't realize uh, <clears throat> I should have kept one of my uh, other magic armors, but oh well, no point. Uh, no no worries. Alright, let's. We got the leather armor in there. Yeah, I'll, hang on, just take a look at this. Okay, it's a leather armor, so it's, you know, base armor class of two plus one, so it's basically base armor class of three. Weighs 10 pounds, you got the gargoyle skull there, what could it possibly come into? Watch Hello this. Get an item. 500 gold. 
And this is what you get, the white bone armor plus two. <laughs> armor class of seven and an armor bonus of plus two. I'm still going to keep the armor of comfort on because of the weight. Uh, but yeah, obviously this thing can self quite a bit. Yeah. Perhaps you should bear some of my And also, load. I forgot to mention that when I was going through the uh, Temple of Tear there, I actually uh, leveled all my other companions up. So I'll, uh, yeah, that's all the time I have for this video. So I'll head back to the Temple of Tear. I'll sell off all my all this other stuff, and then I'll meet you back uh, in the uh, CD Tavern. This is Sirik1983 signing off. Have a good one.